Hey guys! <laughs> okay, today I'm going to visit one of my very, very good friends, Cece Davis, at Skin Spirit here in Austin. So I am going to brave the cold. It is currently like 45 degrees outside, which is very cold for Texas. And I am going to get some touch ups on my filler, on my lips, uh, Botox, and then maybe something else, but I'm not sure. So come follow me. Today we are going to get my lips touched up. We are going to see CC Davis at Skin Spirit in Austin, downtown. Um, she has been a very good friend of not mine for, I would say, wait, it's October. Oh my God, I have known her for, I think it's been three years now. Wow. Damn, CC, love you. But yeah, so she's always been such a great friend to me and she's a very skilled injector. She's been doing this for so long and I trust her and only her and just like I have someone who does, you know, um, my skin for me. Lindsay, shout out to you, babe. We need to get a facial in ASAP. Um, but yeah, no, I've just known them both for so long and uh, I'm just very loyal in like with who I go to and because you know if they do it well like you know if it's not broke don't fix it so like why go to anyone else oh my god okay I'm so excited like y'all have no idea I've missed them all so much and they were such big supporters of me going on the show and of course I had to spill the beans to them like I had to let them know like where I was going and like why they weren't gonna see me for a while because I think I also might have had appointments that I had to like change up and because I only had 22 hours notice till I had to be in Vegas and so that's obviously not enough time to go see them but I'm so excited so let's go inside let's get numbed up let's go meet everyone yes <laughs> Hi, how are y'all? Oh my. Thank you. I did. Say hi to everyone. Hi. <laughs> oh my god. Like literally I was telling Lindsay, I'm like, it just feels like it's been so long. I know it has. Like Pre-COVID. Need this. You want to do a brow lift? Sure. <laughs> Smile up really big. Do it. Smile up really big. Cause it hurts, but like not too much where I feel like I need to get one of those. No, it's it's tolerable. I mean, some people are just not good with needles, though. Mhm. Mm yeah, girl, it's uh. Bachelorette time. <laughs> I actually want to do it. I think it'd be fun. You know what I noticed though? What? Y'all never ate. Oh, well, they're not going to show <laughs> that because they don't want to hear us like chomping. I'm like, they never have, they never feed them. Is that because they don't want them to gain weight on camera? Oh my God, I gained a little bit, like not even gaining weight. It just like, it didn't show on the scale. But it showed on my body. Oh. Like we ate so much. Or and I ate so much. Alcohol in itself. No, you know? we we got limited. Why? Because they don't want you to get wasted. Yeah. <laughs> We're just correcting this little spot right here. I'm like, why am I watching it? <laughs> At least it doesn't make you pass out. Right. You know, some people they just can't stand to watch like a needle. Mm-hmm. Are you doing okay here? Mm-hmm. I don't even feel it. I put lidocaine in there. Ah, my favorite. <laughs> this will help. There's a little bit, well, it looks fluffy now because mm -hmm. we just put that in. And then when it goes down, it'll help some of that weight that's just pushed back there. Mm-hmm. I don't even feel that. How long have you been doing this for? Girl, 12 years. Wow. What did you do before you went into this? I can't remember. Um. Well, plastics forever, uh -huh. but Critical care, cardiothoracic. So blessed to have her doing my lips. Yeah. Now I always go to you. Girl, you better. <laughs> Somebody said something about um, that that she had the best lips on the show, where the guy was like, "Oh, I love your lips." Oh my something. god. Okay, yes. Yeah, so I remember it was Trey. He we did like this 
uh, smooch, uh, marry pie, where you to pie someone, you to kiss someone, and like marry someone. Um, and this guy that was like one of my best friends, like guy friends in the villa, he kissed me, and he's like, I just really want to kiss those lips. <laughs> That. She awesome. did them. Um. <laughs> you remember how small they were, or just how I looked before? Oh, I, I came, came back. In. A pic I had a picture that came across my feet uh -huh. from that long ago, and I was like, "That's not her." I know. <laughs> a lot of people are like, "She just changed her entire face." I'm like, "Well, I wanted to." <laughs> well, we just brought, like you already have really good cheeks and jawline. Like we just keep it where it needs to be and mm -hmm. we keep it structured. We don't like... You're not going to make me look all no, crazy. No, we don't overemphasize you. We just keep detail and support so things stay in place. That's how you don't age. All right, babe. Me... You won't okay. feel anything over here because of that lidocaine. Hell yeah. We've kind of graduated your filler mm -hmm. to a pretty little maintenance filler. So we'll go up in volume very gently. Gentle. Mm -hmm. Gently, is that a word? <laughs> and it'll help keep them nice and detailed without them getting crazy. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm bleeding so much. I stared away from... I almost got coffee today and I was like, wait, <laughs> I know where I'm going. Caffeine will do it. Estrogen, are you by your period? Am I on it? Yes. Well, I'm about to be. Yeah. Well, I bruise you a little bit there. No, you're good. So in the morning, that should settle down like that. Okay. Just popping minis in there to just keep mm -hmm. the momentum going. Okay, we're back. Okay, why do I have this up? Oh my God, I love them. So there was a little excess right here that I saw on the show and that I also saw you know, just like in general that I wanted to kind of like be fixed up. And so we put dissolver in right here. Okay y'all, so it is 636. That means it has been, I would say like two and a half hours since I just got my lips touched up. I got some Botox right in my 11s. I got a brow lift. I also got some, what is it called? <laughs> um, dissolver, I got dissolver put behind my lip, not in my lip, but behind it. So, because sometimes filler can kind of travel back there and that's not where you want it. Cause that gives you like the duck lip face look. I don't know, that's not good. So we saw that that was happening and we took care of that. So I'm gonna be checking in with her in, I would say two days to make sure that it didn't like dissolve any of the filler in the lip. And we're gonna go from there. But yeah, so, so far, it's been pretty good. There is a slight bruising right here. Let me show y'all. Okay, so there's slight bruising in my lip. Uh, not bad at all. So bruising can happen pretty easily if you are out drinking within 24 to 48 hours, like drinking alcohol, drinking caffeine. Um, it can cause you to bleed more, but I didn't do any of those. So I don't know what but I also am about to start my period, so she said that could be another reason that I was bleeding a lot. Slight bruising right here and right here. Not bad at all, that's completely normal. Uh, but yeah, so I'm just chilling at home. I just got back from running an errands. It's really cold outside. We got our house cleaned. It's really dark. Anyway, so we had someone come do that my room what's up but yeah no so she just kind of like picked up um because we've been pretty busy lately and i haven't really had time and like i don't know if y'all are like me but if my room is a mess or if something's not organized i will like be scatterbrained and i can't do anything um until it's done so we got that cleaned we're good to go ready it is currently 9 40 at night and that means it has been about five to six hours since my appointment when I got injected. So now there is a little bit more bruising and then new bruising has popped up. Okay, so there's bruising right here and then slight bruising right here. Nothing really on the bottom. The bottom doesn't really get trauma too easy. This 
she like saw that it bruised kind of like while I was at the doctor at her area and then this one is new bruising now this is obviously swelling so yeah everything's good down here okay so I am not wearing a drop of makeup and I look kind of like trash but it's fine um, it is currently 2 29 in the afternoon uh, it's been I would say it's almost gonna be 24 hours I'd say it'd be 22 hours since I got my lips injected and then I got Botox the Botox you know that takes a while for it to kick in um, but I got some of my 11, some forehead right here. I got a brow lift, so that's going to be fun. Um, now, the, <laughs> the bruising, let's, you know, talk about that. It's a little worse than it was yesterday. I would say swelling is not really bad. I think swelling is perfect. Um, I think the dissolver is, like, definitely doing its job of, like, keeping, like, the back from being too puffy. Um, I'm going to go tell Cece tomorrow about how it's doing, see if I need a little touch-up if it's dissolved um, the right side a little too much. Um, and, yeah.